So, everyone, so, Tristan, uh, I don't know if you guys saw Pacific Rim. I mean, looking at the box office numbers, you may not have. But Tristan and I saw Pacific Rim, and we loved it, right? And there's always been, there's been talk of, like, a sequel. Is it going to happen? I think it got confirmed, but then it seems like it's in production yeah. hell. Or at least it went into production hell. And it looks like Guillermo del Toro isn't going to be a part of the sequel, which is kind of rough, because I would argue he's what made that movie fun, his directing. Mm -hmm. Um, but what's interesting, speaking of Guillermo del Toro as a director, apparently, and I heard this rumor a while ago, but it was never confirmed. I didn't realize it was never confirmed. Apparently his nickname on set was uh, Guillermo, Guillermo del Totoro, as in Totoro from, you know, um, from the classic Miyazaki film, My Neighbor Totoro. Now, right. the reason why I'm having such a hard time and I'm slurring is not because of the drinks that I've had. It is because of the fact that uh, I'm just chuckling at the fact that this is real. Guillermo del Toro confirmed this himself, and apparently what had happened was the, I believe it was the little girl that played, um, okay, well, the actress is named, or the actor is named Mana Ashida. She played young Mako. Yeah. That's why I couldn't remember his name, Mako. So she played right. young Mako, and she just could not pronounce Guillermo del Toro's name. And to be fair, neither can I. So, uh, so I'm not judging her for it, so she couldn't pronounce his name. So somehow, she s just ended up calling him, to she asked, can I call you Totoro-san? And I would assume Guillermo knew, like, yeah, that's, I know where that's from. Right. And yeah. yet, apparently, it's inspired Guillermo del Toro artwork. Like, people are drawing Guillermo del Toro as my neighbor Totoro. Right. And it is hilarious, and both hilarious and adorable, and apparently someone, I don't know if they're real stickers, but they made it look like there's like a sticker set of like, yeah. I don't know if they're real stickers you could buy, but if they are, I'm buying them. I'm buying them and I'm putting them on you. Like, you're not going to notice that there's going to be Guillermo del Toro, Totoro stickers on your back, Tristan. Because right. it is just the funniest thing. You're going to like it. Um, it is just... The funniest thing, the cutest thing, I mean, this is such a, a hilarious story that I just, like, I always, I wanted to, it was one of the things with Tristan where I was like, I want to believe that it's real. <laughs> I, want, I want to believe, but there was always something in the back of my mind that I'm like, no, it's not true. It's just, it's just, you know, someone made a joke somewhere on the internet because it's the internet. But no, it's real. <laughs> Guillermo del Totoro. How do you feel about your neighbor, Guillermo? Guillermo, murmur. <laughs> How do you feel about your new neighbor uh, with his giant robots and his Pan's Labyrinth? How do you feel? I mean, I'll take the robot. All right. Not, not the Labyrinth, though. No. No. Okay. Understandable. I don't like underground mazes, Matt. It's no joke. Yeah. I mean, you know what? I Yeah, I get you. 